game results and another sign? And more on today's news. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, my hot diggity dogs. I'm Reese. And I'm Abby. For lunch today, lines one and two, general sewed chicken, line three closed, line four, soup and salad bar, chicken and rice, and sausage, egg, and cheese biscuit, and line five, assorted four by six pizza. We have but one birthday today. That happy birthday goes out to Mrs. McDonald. And now to Ivan with sports. Good morning, Frank, for high school. For sports today, the tennis team had their first match against Danville. They fell 4-1. Chase Thomas was the only one who won the team point at three singles. Chase did a great job in the third set singles. Chase Thomas won 7-5, 2-6, and 6-0. Next match will be 24, August 24 versus Benton Central at 11. For, for cross country, the boys team won the hot dog invitational in a convincing fashion against Hamilton Heights, Clinton Central, Lafayette Central Catholic, and Arsenal Tech. The girls team fell short to Hamilton Heights by only one point. The boys were led by an individual champ, Hugo Hernandez, while Karina Alanis led the girls with a third place finish. For girls golf, we did not receive the scores by the time of our broadcast, but word is out that they defeated Taylor last night. Congrats, ladies. And now for a special video with Emily and Sydney about the football game tonight. Good morning, hot dogs. I'm Sydney, and I'm here with Emily to talk about tonight's football game. Don't forget that the football game will be at Clinton Central tonight with the kickoff starting at 7. The student section theme will be neon, so make sure to wear your neon and come cheer on the hot dogs. Finally, be sure to follow the student section's Instagram page at FHS underscore student section 2K19. Thanks, guys. Lastly, there will be a wrestling call-out meeting next week. More info to come. I'm Ivan Santos, and now to weather. So today in the weather, it's going to be a relatively cold day with a high of 77 and a low of 60. Less than 10% chance of precipitation all day. In Italian news, it's still 90 degrees there. Uh, global warming. <laughs> What's that? Don't forget to sign up to meet with college reps that are visiting FHS in the next few weeks. There are eight different sign-up sheets and student services. Stop by and check it out. In other news, yesterday Clinton County Sheriff Rich Kelly presented a sheriff's deputy with a special tribute for his service to our country. Deputy Ryan West is a re retired Marine Corps who served for 18 years. West requested his vehicle got new decals as the current ones were tatted and worn. Sheriff Kelly decided to pay tribute to West's service by wrapping his vehicle. What a way to recognize his services to his country. A new gateway sign has been installed on the east side of Frankfurt featuring the historic Case Arena. We are grateful to the Frankfurt Future Leaders, Leaders Advisory Council for their vision in bringing gateway signs to our city, as this is our third sign here in town. A special shout out goes to the Frankfurt Street Department for installing the sign early, earlier this week. That's it for today's news. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to, your, to our YouTube channel. Happy Friday, hot dogs.